Hello, uh, everybody. It's David here. I'm here with Taylor. And, um, do I have something interesting to talk about today? <clears throat> I did a rant about two months ago about Part of Me 3D, the Katy Perry movie. While I am pleased that it's a box office flop, I have bad news. You see, Hollywood never ceases to amaze me. Screw you. Put that down. <laughs> Hollywood never ceases to amaze me with their stupidity and everything. Because I just heard <clears throat> that part of me is going to become a Nickelodeon television series. I'm not aware if it's going to be live action. I'm not aware if it's going to be animated. All I know is that this is almost more unnecessary than the movie. There is literally no reason this should exist. I mean, what what's your opinion on it, Taylor? Um, okay, I like her music. Um, I like just about every type of music, so I dig her music. The movie was a little overboard. She's only had two albums out. Wait, Why so you're telling me you didn't anything? see the movie? I didn't see it. Oh. Um, but the making a movie is a little overboard because she's only had two albums. Um, sure she's had like five or between five to six or seven hits or something, but still, there's no need to make a movie. Why would you feel the need after a box office um, flop? Why would you feel the need to make one? I don't get Katie's. I don't just. I just don't get it. My I actually haven't heard about that. Until you just said it. So about the TV show. Yeah. Um. I'm not very happy about this at all. I think it's a terrible idea. And I don't understand why even Nickelodeon would go along with it. I mean, it just sounds terrible. And there have only been, sorry to interrupt you, there have only been probably two or three um, movies that have been released by singers that have actually been successful. Like, and they were all by the Beatles. Um, help, um, Hard Day's Night, The Let It Be. Um, I can't really think of anything else. Yellow Submarine. Any other movie. Yellow Submarine. I can't think of any other music movies that have been successful. Um, and after it flopped, I, it, it amazes me. Like, why would, why would you feel the need to make a TV show after it? If they're actually gonna do that, I hope it's animated. I'm just throwing that out there. I hope it's animated just so I don't have to see Katie's face right now because that really pisses me off. I don't really want... I don't want it to be animated, though. I think that would be terrible. An animated Katy Perry TV show? I mean... I think it might be something like... It might be like the reverse Hannah Montana, if you think about it. I I guess... I don't know about that. Think about it, okay? You've got, okay, you've got your Katy Perry movie. Whatever. You've got, oh, by the way, I'd like to tell you she covered Kate Jude in that movie. Um, so, you know, I mean... <laughs> so, the movie, the movie, fine. You know, though, you know, a TV show, you know... Fine, just, I mean, why would you, I mean, don't animate it, I mean, that's a, that's an awful idea, it, it really is. Well, it's Nickelodeon, you said it's Nickelodeon, right? Or Disney yes, or... but as much as I love Nickelodeon, with a burning passion, there is no way whatsoever I can stand seeing a Katy Perry television series. Now, 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 granted, if Nickelodeon decided they wanted to air a Russell Brand animated series, I'd, I'd watch that. 
effects has already done it, but not animated. It it's probably one of the greatest shows much. I've seen in a Yeah, it's probably one of the greatest shows I've seen in a while. I've heard Funny. good things about it. Now, see, after Katy Perry and them got married, I was like, okay, how is this going to work out? This is not going to last long. First of all, because he's, like, a douchebag, because of... Um, he... Just Russell Brand, like, in general, like, with all of his relationships and everything, that's not going to work out with Katy Perry. I just wanted to see how funny it would be in the end. It ended up being, what, like, three months or something? Now no, he's becoming even more like popular. That. It's like... It's like, I want him, if, you know what, here, if you're going to have a part of me TV show, at least involve Russell Brand in it. At least have the occasional, at least have the occasional him hiding from a camera, all like, Katie, I don't want to be here. You know, I mean, just have him, you know, I mean, have him be Russell Brand for the sake of it, for humor. I mean... Don't. If it's an anime, they might actually, because in the part of me movie, they um, talk about supposedly like the like the whole thing with Russell Brand. Um, so maybe they might actually include that in the television show. If they do an anime, they'll have an anime Russell Brand that does that. Katie, why am I a cartoon? <laughs> I don't think I like this much. Goes on ranting at the audience through camera, animation camera. I'm stuck in your telly, get me out! I don't think it's safe here! He's so easy to impersonate. No, but it sounds like, I mean, it's such a terrible idea! When did they release that? I haven't even heard anything about that, dude. I don't know. I'm hoping it's fake, though. I was on the Wikipedia page looking at box office information on the show. Oh, God. And it mentioned... <laughs> or on the movie, my bad. And it mentioned, you know, that they're going to make a show. And I'm like, no. Let me see if I can find any more info on it. Hold on. I'm going to Google it, too. I've seen like previews of the part of me moving when she was advertising on like Jay Leno and whatever show she was on. Um, and I feel like the grandma, her grandma is like the best character in the movie. Um, well, character. Um, she just like puts down everything they do and it's like, um, who does? She's sarcastic about everything. Who? Um, her grandma. Okay. I think that's the best part of the Katy Perry. If they were to put that in the television series, I think I might actually watch that just to hear her insults. You know, I mean, I still don't know how I feel about it. It still sounds like it's a terrible idea. You know, I mean, and honestly... Can you drag the story about a girl that started out as a Christian artist, failed, became mainstream, and released two albums, and succeeded into an hour and 35 minute movie? It, I don't even, it's a, on her tour, right? Like, the movie's based on her tour this year, right? No, the movie's it, based on her! Like, it's just a life story, like an autobiography, kind of. It's thing. literally like. The the, sh the movie is her entire concert tour and her entire career, like as a whole, from when she started as a Christian artist and failed to when she became the mainstream artist she is and somehow succeeded. I mean, it's retarded as all crap. I'm actually looking this up now. I've got it. <laughs> All right, guys. Um, look it up when you get the chance. I'm hoping it's fake, but there's a possibility because people are dumb. So, um, 
Well, I'm David Gracia. Hey, Lovejoy. Peace. Peace, guys.